Greetings YouTube, welcome back to the channel. I want to start off by shouting out Coda Williamson, who reached out to the channel with this information via Evazone. Coda, I appreciate uh, you doing that, and keep in mind, as we, I continue to promote, and KT1 continues to promote the joint competition that we are doing for your quote-unquote artwork, for memes, to, uh, to laugh, to have fun, to have you enter to win the contest uh, for the weekly free uh, Odin opportunity, especially for July 4th sales, leading up to the grand prize of $500 worth of July 4th sales. Remember, there are some rules. You've got to have a PayPal account. You've got to be subscribed to both of our channels. You've got to submit the artwork. Um, and eventually, if you want the grand prize, we're trying to grow this community and uh, really take advantage of the service. And so we want you to hopefully invite a friend, but, you know, easy enough, an alliance mate, for sure. Uh, with that being said, I I have to give Kabam credit where credit's due. And I know, like, my channel is sort of a strange one to follow sometimes when it comes to tone. Because I can praise Kabam, and then I can immediately be critical of Kabam. Or I can immediately go from being critical of Kabam to praising them. Every topic is its own diagnosis. I kind of imagine my channel and all the videos I produce like an etch-a-sketch where once I've covered the topic, unless there's you know a need for it to have a couple of follow-ups, which 90%, maybe 95% of the time, there is not a need for a follow-up, I shake it and go into the next issue fresh. The one exception to this being if I grade an offer and then keep that offer in mind, like I keep talking about the February monthly card for Thronebreakers because it is now June and the February monthly card is still the best value we've seen. I also remind you all that I do purchase sometimes deals that I give an average grade to, like a C, because the need for them, like for, for instance, for rank up materials might be more than usual, but I still get this criticism that I can give an offer an F and buy it. I, I don't do that. That's, that's not what I do. But sometimes I do buy a C or a C plus, but I usually only try to buy A's and B's and I gave an offer a B two days ago and I still didn't buy it. So, you know, it's hit or miss. With that being said, for those of you who live in countries or can access a VPN uh, to one of these countries, you have a chance to get some really exciting, rare two stars. Now you might say to yourself, two stars? Why should I care about two stars? Well, Kabam has made it known that they are still looking, maybe this year, maybe not, to bring back some events where you can only say use two-star champions because they know that outside of, and I used to say even the arena, but you don't really use the arena normally for, with two stars. So outside of special arenas where you actually get points for using your smaller star champs like one stars and two star champs that we've seen, you're not going to use them. The road to a million five-star shard points is an example of two stars you might use. But regardless, there are also people out there who just want to collect every champion you can as a trophy, even as a two-star. And this is a dream uh, month for you collectors because for 30,000 points, which is not that many, uh, and you can see this man had 145,500 points entering this video, you can get a two-star Hercules, a two-star Angela, a two-star Iceman, and three two-star collector crystals along with five crystal shard crystals and five small energy refills using, of course, the Marvel Insider promotion. And yes, you limit one, must have a valid Marvel Contest of Champions account, Marvel Insider account, and be a U.S. resident to redeem. So uh, this is a very important um, point because a lot of my subscribers, and I'm very thankful for that, uh, don't live in the U.S. and they might be a little salty about this, but keep in mind that there are are some ways around it, or so I've been told. I just don't have those specifics. You might want to ask around on Reddit or Line, etc. Um, okay, so that was offer one, but there are multiple chances for this. So you can see the Contest of Legacies starter bundle also this month. And uh, let's go on to this how about this another 30,000 point cost two star retro two star mordo and two star america chavez 
along with two star Professor X, five small energy refills, and a truly pathetic amount of gold. Now, again, U.S. residents. But I've known some people who have claimed over the past couple years to live in other places and still be able to access this. I'm not going to tell you how. Just, just ask around. So, rare two stars are exciting and not always common in the Marvel Insider offers. But in this case, it's just a really welcome addition to the contest and something that I will certainly be taking advantage of as I buy up both these offers very soon. So, uh, thank you so much to uh, everybody who's passed this on to me, especially Coda Williamson. I hope you all who have access to this or can have access to this take advantage of it because it's a really cool way to get special two-star champions and who knows maybe that two-star hercules will save you and get you some really cool rewards by the end of the year we just don't know month to month but the better uh, two-star roster i think the better the chance of that happening